what we have here is massive. It's the beginning of a lot of good things in Africa. It's very rich in content. It's very rich in design. Rising like a vessel on the rocks of Abiokuta, southwest Nigeria, is Olushego Basanjo's presidential library, an architectural masterpiece housing records and objects that define a great man with legendary achievements. The library gives the world an opportunity to travel through the life and times of one of Africa's greatest icons of change. It is the first of its kind in Nigeria. No one has done anything like it before. This presidential library was the very first one. It's the very first one outside the USA. The project began before the Mexican presidential library. The library stretches across 32 hectares of land, an equivalent of 40 football pitches. It's a tourism hub and a one-stop center for human development. If you want to know about leadership in Africa, you want to know about the Nigerian political history, you want to know about how, as a human being, you can influence what happens beyond your continent, then you need to be here. It is going to change the lot of young people in Nigeria and indeed Africa. It has the vision to foster the development of young people in Africa to enable them to change and transform their societies. President Mbasojo has really committed a lot of things and he's actually convinced that his life should be uh, an example for many generations to come so that they can be a living example for their own generation. Working in OOPL, working with His Excellency Chief Olusha Mwabasanjo has been a very big inspiration for me. From arrival to the exit point, Chief Olusha Mwabasanjo's signatures are bold. The entire complex of OOPL has redefined tourism in Ogun State. It has redefined tourism in Abelkuta. This is the story of Olushengo Basenjo Presidential Library. To understand the story, let's start from the beginning. 